got that one purple that one purple car doing games man cd games man cd games or something too i wonder when they started adding computer classes to schools like 90s masses yeah probably in the, like the masses mass like what percentage of schools because like does every uh, is like i don't know i feel like a computer class is kind of like it's probably like a rich school thing first yeah probably and so i don't know if like it's like a government thing that every school has to have like at least one tech class or not but like but there's also not really like computer i remember going to element and like there was computer classes yeah right like how to like, right. type how, like are there computer classes now i think so like elementary probably I think but it was so. like it was like i feel like there might not be because like it was kind of even weird thinking about it because i well, kind of maybe haven't... maybe not like now now because they like probably use ipads for everything anyway but like yeah maybe from like 1995 to like 2013 or something well, like computer classes were like split like but I also went to did, private did, school. Did so. you go to Did you go to computer classes or no? Yeah. What did you Even, do? Well, in like elementary school, we learned how to type. Yeah. And then like just use like basic programs, and then in like high school, we had computer classes where we would like learn how to like make presentations and like use Photoshop and stuff. Yeah, yeah. But in the beginning, it was like the basic: how does a computer work? The start button. This is the internet. This is like how you use Word. I like low-key forgot about computer classes in elementary school. Yeah, I remember you, I had computer class and I had music class. Those were the two classes that were, like, extra. There was a computer lab. I forgot what <coughs> we did. I think it was probably just typing, but, like, we... That's weird. I forgot about that. We played this little game called Snoods, and it basically taught you how to, like... That sounds familiar. Like, basically organize data. Oh, really? Yeah. And, like, I didn't know what I was doing at the time, but now I'm like, okay, you're teaching us how to, like, group files and, like, drag them to the trash can and name things. This is weird. Yeah. It was... Snood Advanced. I never played Snood. Snood. I'm trying to remember what we did in there. I remember... How do you learn to type? I don't think this is the game. Um, I don't really remember... But like, like I had, like I was on, I was on a computer in preschool. Snooze computer game, game. I don't know where this game is. How did I learn how to type? I don't know. <laughs> to learn how to type, I use a game called Type to Learn Three. You know oh fuck! I remember this game. Type to Learn Three. And we had to like fucking. So it was like little exercises, and the teacher like would put like a piece of paper over our hands so that we couldn't look at the keyboard <laughs> nice. and we would and we would learn and we would like type these things and there were like a couple kids that were like really good at typing yeah. and they were like they were like different levels and there was one kid named kyle and he like he was just a fucking wizard and he was like level 25 and if you finish the whole program you get to like just play games like yeah, yeah computer class and everyone was like on like level 10 level 9 and i wasn't that good i was like super bad and that was like maybe second, third grade. And then I started playing Club Penguin and I was mm -hmm. typing like faster than I thought. I was like, what the fuck? How do I know how to type all this shit so fast? I was like, oh, it's from that game. But I yeah. don't think I use this. I forget. I forget, man. I I'm sure that there was some, some typing games involved. But like kids kind of just know how to type now, yeah? yeah I'm sure they have to like, that? I'm sure you have to teach them. Oh yeah, we had those fucking... God, I'm looking at this picture of a kids in the computer lab right now with the keyboard covers. Yeah. I'm just like, well, what the hell? Computer class, dude. I completely forgot about that, but I can, <laughs> I can picture the room, man. I can picture the room. It was a dark, it was a dark room. <laughs> I don't know why it was dark. Maybe like, oh, technology is dark. Yeah. And I was like, dude, and the teacher knew a lot about, a, a lot about computers. Yeah. Obviously. As a teacher to elementary school kids, freaking yeah, yeah, and he was like cool too. He like dumbed it down. I don't know his uh profession. Like I don't know if he was like a programmer, but he could tell he's like a nerd. <laughs> Probably been studying it since like the eighties or something. <laughs> he's like, he's like, I just want to teach these kids. I fucking remember his name too. I'm gonna fucking look him up right now. He's just freaking. He's just blockchaining it up, dude. 
Dude, I had I had a teacher who uh who was one of my like favorite elementary school teachers and he does like real estate. I'm like, yeah, dude, let's go with this real estate, Jeff. Like, let's go with it. Found all right, him. All right, go hard. Found him, found him. What's he doing? Uh his his LinkedIn is loading, but I'm looking at uh one of his reviews. It says the teacher was strict and mean. Oh, lame. But like I don't no, nah, I don't remember that. He was pretty nice. I mean, is this an elementary school person reviewing? I don't know. Why won't this load? I just want to see this guy. I want to see what he's up to. Cool stuff. Cool stuff. Fingers crossed for cool stuff. For Mr. Snood. All right. I'm going to look him up on Google Chrome.